Okay, so welcome back to Nautilus Biker USA on the 2023 Royal Enfield Himalayan, better known as Dozer. D O Z E R. You can see here we have the, I don't know if this is the Chattahoochee River, I'm not quite sure, private property, but finding these ADV routes is not easy because. It's all going by other people's postings and enter here, make a left at the hardware store. I know there's a, uh, they say a forest service map. I got to find that. So this starts off as blacktop and apparently turns into off-road and gravel but this part right here just parallels the river which is pretty nice I mean you could ride a Harley back here right here on this easy peasy so let's look for some more challenging and difficult terrain so we can keep honing our skills and learning and see what we can do uh, somebody lives back here All right, this looks... Oh, man. There we go. No more pavement. And lots of rain we had. So this is gravel. Oh, you know what? Never remember to do this. Got to get in the habit. 1,000, 3, 1,000, 4, 1,000, 5. There it goes. Alright, so now it's blinking. Hooligan mode engaged. Alright, so we got some truck traffic on this uh, early start. I have no idea how easy or difficult this gets. It's an 18 mile loop. And this, uh, if you're up in the Chattahoochee area, is Forest Service Road number 44. So, finding them as we go. I'm keeping notes so I know where to go for the future. Yeah, there was a lot of rain last night. I seem to be always on these roads after hard rain. Lots of mud, lots of sliding. Part of the fun. So, let's check this out right here. Just pull over. Now the only thing is, every time you turn the key off, you gotta turn the button back on to engage the ABS, so. Make sure we got good footing here. <coughs> good dog, stay. All right. This is pretty awesome, look at this. Oh, this is slick, but always a good stop along the way. A little river action. So let's get back on here and uh, this is like hard packed gravel. We need some more of the fun stuff. Alright, first things first, dummy. Turn off the EBS. One, one thousand. What we got here? We got a little bridge. Yeah, check this out. Pretty awesome, eh? Look at that. Mm -hmm. 
Uh, it's a little dead end. Take a quick picture of this, eh? Look at this. ABS disengaged. All right, here we go. Oh, here we go. Oof, more loose gravel. Wow, look at this. Man, another awesome trail. Are you kidding me? Oh, this is like speed bumps. Look at this. Wham, wham, wham. Oh, yeah. Now we're getting better. Let's see what gear we're in. We're in second gear. Boy, you got to watch these blind turns or traffic, boy. So we'll do a little stand in here. Oh, look at this. Like a little jump. Oh, boom. Oh, right in the mud. <laughs> yeah, buddy. Oh, this is like BMX style back here. Look at this. Woo cruising and standing. Oh, wham. Oh, yeah. Stepping and pressing, getting around them turns. Boom, big rock, wham. Boom, woo. Look at that. Stepping and pressing. Oh, this is real blind here. All right, had to sit down for a minute. Just because of that. Oof. Oh, big work. Love the puddles. Look at that. Yeah. So I'm just standing and turning, standing and turning, using the old step and press technique, ripping through. Look at this little mud. So this is a lot of loose gravel. Nothing too gnarly. A couple of big, oof, yeah, there's little bumps. Oh, so you got a campground back here, eh? Low Gap Creek Campground. Whoa, whoa look at that one. Oh, now we're getting really gnarly. Little little water crossing. Yeah, baby. How about it? We got going on back here. subject to flooding. Oh, we got our first water crossing. Oh, let's go. Yeah. 
But we made it. Look at that. They closed that road. Crap. Jerks. Here's the map of the trail. The red X is where the gate was closed. Due to heavy rains the night before, USFS closed the remainder of the trail. Let's try the water crossing standing this time, eh? Keep it tight. Look at this. How awesome is this trail? Gotta stay close to that line though, no, because you don't know if anybody else is coming. I wish these were one way. Oh. Boy, standing is getting so comfortable, especially turning with the step and press technique just using second gear coming through here look at this ready so oof. so let's use the step and press and then try to break traction awesome how fun was that through boom let's hit these bumps oof step and press all right, now you got some squirrely, squirrely mud here. Get through that. Whoa. Oh, almost lost it. Whole rear end. <laughs> that was awesome. All right, we stalled because I popped the clutch. So let's uh, let's just roll right here. Good save. And it's neutral. All right. Let the adventure continue! That was fun. So that, <laughs> that whole back end slid out and just started getting away from me. That is where better tires will come in handy for sure. Doesn't stop the adventure! Look at that, here we go. Whoop! Get a little air there. Look at these. Whoop! Yes, sir, yeah, buddy. Alright, got another blind turn. With a hump. Oh, slid that tire around, Did you hear it? Went good too. Yeah. Another blind turn. These would be way more fun if they were one way. Nothing like coming around and seeing the front end of a car or a bike. Although if you're bringing your car back here, it's not a low rider. You know when you had a lot of fun? When your boots and your jeans are soaked and muddy. Heading back out, heading back out to civilization. We see this is blacktop, but pretty fun ride for a little short course, a new discovery right along the river. Can't be beat. Squirrel, you better dodge or you're gonna get it. And then you check out all these houses here. And then there's a, uh, a tubing business right here pretty cool so if you ever want to go tubing kayaking thanks for watching don't forget